Hi everyone. This is example four on relative on rotated vessels. I would like to present the solution. Here is the problem: an open top right circular cylinder, 0.9 meter in diameter and 1.5 meters high, is filled with oil of specific gravity 0.84 to a depth of 1.2 meters. The tank is rotated about its vertical axis. Determine the pressure in kilopascals on the bottom 0.15 meters from the axis of rotation for the following cases. The tank is rotated to such maximum angular speed without spilling any water. The tank is rotated at 90 rpm revolutions per minute and the tank is rotated at 150 revolutions per minute. So let's draw the figure first so that we can analyze it well. So the radius is 0.45, half of 0.9, 1.5 meters high, and it's filled with oil of specific gravity 0.84 and 1.2 meter deep, meters deep. So therefore, this is 1.5 minus 1.2, so 0.3 meter, the value of K. And this is point B on the bottom. So for the first question, the tank is rotated to such maximum angular speed without spilling any water. The maximum height of the parabolic surface without spilling any water should be times 2 of 0.3, so 0.6, as shown in the figure. Then the distance of B from that imaginary parabolic surface of zero pressure because it is exposed to the atmosphere is denoted by HB. So therefore, the pressure at B is gamma of oil times HB. Then to solve for HB, we apply squared property of parabola. So if that is 0 0.6, 2 times 0 0.3, so this must be 1.5 minus, 1 minus 0 0.6, so 0.9 meter. Then this is HB minus 0.9 as to 0.15 square equals 0.6 as to 0.45 square. So Pressure at B is gamma of oil times HB. To solve for HB by squared property of parabola, HB minus 0.9 as to 0.15 square equals 0.6 as to 0.45 square. So HB is equal to 0.9667 meter. Therefore, the pressure at B is 0.84 times 9.81 gamma of oil times 0.9667. So pressure at B is 7.966 kilopascals. Then for the second part, the tank is rotated at 90 rpm. Let's compute for the height H2 first using the formula 0 0.0005589 omega square 90 square times radius 0.45 square. So H sub 2 is equal to 0.9167 meters. So it should, which is less than 1.5, so the vertex still above the bottom center, and it is as shown in the figure. So this is 0.9167 meter. Therefore, this is 1.5. 1.5 minus 0.9167 is 0.5833 meter. Then HB is the distance from B to the imaginary parabolic surface of zero pressure. So again, this is HB minus 0.5833, apply squared property of parabola HB minus 0.5833 as to 0.15 square equals 0.9167 as to 0.45 square. Solving for HB, HB is 0.6852 meter. So pressure at B is 0.84 times 9.81 times 0.6852. So pressure at B is 5.646 kilopascals. Then when the angular speed is 150 rpm, substitute into this formula, H3 equals 0 0.0005589, 150 square times 0.45 square. Then it is equal to 2.546 meters, which is greater than 1.5. So the parabolic surface will extend beyond the bottom center and therefore portion of the bottom will be exposed. So let's compute for that radius of the exposed bottom. 
by computing this distance first because the total height is 2.546 minus 1.5 so that means this is 1.046 meter then we will call this radius r sub 3 and let's compare it with 0.15 if it is less than 0.15 then there is pressure at b but if it is greater than 0.15 then b will be exposed to the atmosphere so therefore pressure at b will be zero so to solve for rt by squared property of parabola 1.046 as to r3 square equals 2.546 the total height as to 0.45 square so r sub 3 is equal to 0.2884 meter which is greater than 0.15 so that means b will be exposed to the atmosphere and therefore the answer to the third question is pressure at p will be zero so that's it and i hope that we're able to follow the solution